Show you how to set up Google ads conversion tracking for form submissions. Okay, so I'm in a Google ads account and you go to goals, right? And then you go to summary and then you're going to see create a conversion action. So I'm gonna go ahead and click this. Now I'm gonna hit website. So do the scan and then just scroll down and hit add conversion actions manually, okay? This is going to be a submit lead form. Now you've got this option, conversion action optimization options. You have primary, you have secondary. Primary is what you're going to want this on. To. This allows smart bidding to learn off of this conversion. If I set it to secondary, it does not influence your smart bidding at all within your bidding strategies. So I'm going to have this set to primary. You should too, if it's a, a, a form submission that you're obviously trying to set up. Now I am going to put account review. Now there's a value, right? For us, it's a form submission. So we're basically going to set the value to one. Count, I set this to one, it's a form submission. Well, with lead form submissions, we don't want every conversion counted if, if it's just one person, right? So then you've got your click-through conversion windows. In this case, I don't change any of this. The rest of these settings are fine. Attribution, I leave to data-driven. You really only have two options now, last click or data-driven. Um, I yield to data-driven these days. and you should as well, especially if you're going to be using smart bidding. All right, I'm going to hit done. Okay, so here it is. You see submit lead form, my conversion name, everything's set up. I'm going to hit save and continue. We have generated over $50 million in revenue for our clients using Performance Max campaigns. We decided we're going to download our knowledge of Performance Max campaigns into a free, easy, practical course and just give it away to the community. Go grab this free course and I'll see you inside.